Hello Capricorn, welcome back to the Tarot Tanvi. I am Tanvi, this is my studio, these are my tarot cards and this is your weekly prediction for the week September 4 to September 11. So I just saw your cards and I, I just read this story and it was very funny. Okay, so we have the Nine of Cups, which is a card of wish fulfillment, okay, wish coming true. And then we have the Fool card, which is a card of new beginnings or like taking the leap of faith. And we have the Six of Swords, which is like about moving to a new location, going to calmer waters or just shifting or feeling just newer, okay? And then we have Not, which has unsuccessful plans. <laughs> so this is really like, so we have a couple of mixed messages. What I'm getting is like the first funny story. I feel like, you know, you suddenly feel like, oh yes, I have what I wanted, yay. This is what I prayed for and this is the wish fulfillment that you're getting. This could be like moving to a new apartment or getting a new job or whatever it is new that you have been praying for and you are hoping for. I feel like for most of it, it's like moving to a new place. And then you have the full energy, you're just so excited. You take the leap of faith and you go to the next place and you do that thing and Six of Swords again, you travel, you trust and you just go and travel. And then with the unsuccessful plans, I feel like Capricorn, since you're so attached to everything that you plan and you're like such a planner, <laughs> I feel like not everything will be going according to your plan. You might go to that place and realize that, you know, if it's a new apartment that you're moving into, it could be like uh, the pictures were showing you a different <laughs> scenario and the real scenario was, was like a little different. I know like I'm laughing but this will not make you feel sad alright. This, this is not like a sad, sad and successful plan. Like it's not like you got your wish, like this is not a wish granted. This is like a curse or something like it's, it's not a bad week at all. This is that things that you are expecting in your head in terms of whatever wish fulfillment you're getting this week might not be exactly what you think they are alright. So just like uh, keep your excitement levels a little lower because I feel like you might feel a little dis a little bit disappointed with your living arrangements this week in general if not like if you don't if that message doesn't resonate with you then I feel like again like you might feel like yes finally I feel very free or very happy or you know emotionally very fulfilled and then you're like yeah let's do this new activity I'm gonna do this new thing this new exercise regime new diet regime then you finally start to do it and expect that you know it would help you feel better and it doesn't so you know like that kind of an energy i'm getting for you for this week but then you know what this is teaching you capricorn is that it's not important that life would go according to your plans and it's high time that you understand that life is not like you are not the only person who's writing your life right so uh, it is said that you're supposed to co-create with the universe like don't even allow the you, you know everything to depend on your destiny you co-create your destiny you take actions and allow things to come to you you know so you co-create with the universe you work on yourself you work on the energy you make plans but don't expect that every plan would always be successful or every diet regime or every exercise regime or every person you date you will eventually marry just don't make such high expectations this week, Capricorn. But it's like gonna be very funny. This is something like you would share with your friends and you would tell that and you would just have a like have like a nice laugh. So yeah, so that's something that you should learn from this week, uh, Capricorn. I hope this was helpful in some way and it made some sense. And I'm gonna see you again next time. So please don't forget to check out his sun, moon and rising signs as well for a more detailed and personalized reading.